Today, I am no longer a bodybuilder because I'm becoming an IG fit girl. The most important part of the day is setting up the Instagram account because social media is directly related to your self-worth. So I'm no longer Will, I am Will T Fit. And the first thing that we need to do in our bio is add that we are a personal trainer because all fit girls are virtual personal trainers, right forearm specialists. So there we go. Do I need an emoji for that one? No. Just like candles on a birthday cake, we gotta add a peach emoji to show people what they're wishing over. So we're gonna add a peach and, and a flexing arm, girl power and stuff like that. Okay. And a rose. And then just in case if Drake wants to hit me up, I gotta add my location. Now, 30% of my following will be other influencers only following me for a follow back, and the other 70% will be men who only get head when they pour a glass of beer. That said, we're still gonna look cute. We're still gonna stay very active on this thing. Now come get ready with me. People think getting ready for the gym is easy, but those are the same type of people that think that dick pics count as foreplay. And they're definitely not the kind to recognize the deadlift platform as the stage it is. This is stressful stuff. Like what if Kristen wore this last week? God forbid you break the 30 day no repeats rule. Why does it feel like no waste is high enough today? The list goes on and on, but when you find the one, you just know. I feel like I look like a fit girl or a, or, a, or a used tampon, but I feel cute, um, feel confident. Will T, checking in. The first thing on the menu today is an oat milk latte. Why oat milk? Because who the hell drinks cow's milk in my Instagram feed already helped milk a few nuts this morning. Oat milk is just absolutely essential. 80 calories per cup. This thing is just so cute. For the main meal, we're making an acai bowl, which is colorful enough to match my personality, but more importantly, my gym fit. We're gonna have all the colors of the earth here because, you know, bright colors equals fitness, okay? So, we've got a nice berry medley. And then there, we've got some blueberries. And then I have this, like, this cranberry powder. It's really good for you. It's loaded with, um, it just matches my socks. And then we're gonna add some protein because you can't have your cake and eat it too, though I do get a lot of offers. So we're gonna add one scoop of some birthday cake whey protein, the new BPN flavor. Oh my God, they have little sprinkles, that's so cute. And oh my God, the scooper is even a different color. It's not like see-through. Maybe a little cute ice cubes. Come on, how do you work this thing, man? Okay, so just like when I do my Instagram Reels, I'm gonna do minutes of research here. Ooh, now that is pretty, and we're gonna make it even prettier. I have this banana, I'm gonna give it more of a purpose besides helping me pay off my student loans with my OnlyFans, so I'm gonna dice it up. That's what happens when you stare at my ass at the gym. And this is my beautiful heaven in a bowl, a side bowl. This meal just screams flat tummy and glute fuel. I'm excited. Like I, I know there's many heroes out there. I just want to be a food one and this one just this one is stealing the spotlight right now, I'm, and, I'm, and I'm not liking that. I'm not liking that one bit, so we gotta eat it right now. This isn't fit girl etiquette, man. Mm! I needed a stronger reminder of my favorite nut in Italy, beyond just my memories of Fabio. So I had to add some pistachios. The roastedness just contrasts the freshness of the fruit. It's gonna make you regular, too. Fit girls, just like bodybuilders, drink a lot of caffeine, especially oat milk lattes. It takes a lot of energy to run through all the minds of the guys at the gym. So usually three to four of these a day. Hey angels, you guys know I'm going to my safe space right now, which is the gym. And you always know that two scoops equals big glutes. So I have some BPN electrolytes as always. My stuff is in the link in the description. Make sure to check it out. Really, make sure to check it out. Let's go to the gym. We are at the gym and I was able to source a real live, in the flesh, like a real Toronto fit girl. We have, you go, you go by like, your name's Melissa. Melissa, but you I like, go by Mel. 
So you identify as a fit girl, right? Yeah. Okay. What's the biggest misconception of a fit girl? Uh, we don't actually look like this all the time. Like whatever you see on social media and like our poses, it's um, it happens for like five or ten seconds. I mean, I didn't expect to be like I, I stand out even more. <laughs> I'm going it's for like you went full red. There's no breakup of colors. It's just yeah. It's full like red. this sexy Elmo cosplay. I mean, Elmo sexy as is, but like, yeah. how do you rate the fit? I give it a seven out of ten. Seven because for effort. I'll give you like a six and a half out of ten, which we can talk about later. <laughs> I'm just surprised you guys actually work out. Oh, we work out. Trust me. Oh, obviously we're starting off with some hip thrusts first, and I was like, do we need the cushion for the bar? And she's like, yeah, I brought my own. Who brings their own hip thrust cushions? So you don't have a green one? I don't. I know it's, <laughs> it's I think you're a fit. I, what's your hip thrust PR? Um, three plates and 15. What? <laughs> don't laugh at me in the middle of the set. Be a little difficult. Don't slam your weights in the gym. Are your fitness goals like you want to be able to like walk into like a knife fight and use your glutes as like defense? Like what's exactly, like, just kind of like bump yeah. them out of the way. Her face does not change from rep to rep to rep. It's like she's always Instagram ready for a shot. You're always Instagram ready. It's just like you have, you have like this like this. This is rep one. This is rep eight. <laughs> Stop smiling at me. This is serious. She gave me a tip after every set. She said to look back at it. Wow, I just I look at mine all day. Give it a wiggle. <laughs> See, mine has like, the thing is that, I don't know, it's like, mine has no like, like recoil, you know what I mean? <laughs> Powerlifting with our glutes right now. Oh my god. Oh, you might. All right, now you got this. Good job. I'm seeing like black spots. <laughs> Holy shit. We have encouraged Melissa to go for a PR right now. So 365 hip thrust. How many reps are you gonna go for? I'll go for two. No, you got four. Two, two more. Two, three, one more. It's about the ego, not with the form. Go. Yes. We're testing new glute boundaries oh. today. If I get five reps, Melissa has to post an Instagram selfie with white socks and black shoes. Fine. Black Adidas, white Nike socks. I do that even too. Worse. What's wrong with that? That's even worse. I'm just here to lift, you know? Like I just. Ready for social suicide? I had some momentum on those thrusts too. Like I was, I was thrusting like I was yeah. mad at it. Do you ever feel like as a girl, there's like a pressure to look a certain way in the gym? For sure. I mean, yeah. I always feel like kind of anxious about that because like I used to come in the morning wearing sports bras, feeling fine. It's funny because like Katie, I met her at the gym, and she like the complete. She's like wearing like baggy <laughs> shirt, no yeah. matching. She's like beats with like tape on. I still see her. I'm like, <laughs> like what? The <laughs> I'm gonna put you on the spot right now. How much would you say that you spend per month or per year on gym fit? Oh my god, my boyfriend's not watching this, but um, six grand. This is interesting. I do, I do buy a lot of gym fits, but I also sell a lot of them. I do get a lot of creepy messages, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Of just guys being like, can you deliver these to me wearing them? I'm like, no. Very, very weird, but uh, I mean, the price is right, right? Oh. Sure. She also totally said that she underballed that. She didn't want to upset anybody watching. It's not going anywhere. That, that's like a. You just hit a brick wall. Oh my gosh. 
Is that like too high? A little high. Ronaldo. Huh? Do you like what you see? <laughs> Next up we have dumbbell sumo squat, four sets of eight, and she just she just goes right off the bat and grabs the one tens. What the you also will notice a fit girl always squats so so below parallel. Like that's like that's like your way of flexing at the gym. Like if you don't go parallel, you might as well book your tickets to get a butt because you're, you're you're getting no abs. I'd usually set up my tripod like behind me or whatever, and then do a shot, run back and forth a hundred times until until yeah, until you get the perfect one. Exactly. Work with what you have. That's like a, such an insult. Work with what you have. Man, this is hard. And then you know, I think you have parts of your body that I don't have. <laughs> do I have to like spread my you, cheeks? You do you have to spread it. Put yourself out and push your butt out. Like that? Yeah. <laughs> I think the ass sweat kind of ruins it. No, I think it's great. Okay. Especially the red. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. What? Embrace what you have. Don't, oh, really? don't push it up. Okay. You're gonna take this hip and like scoop it around. Oh. <laughs> oh. We have to pee. <laughs> I do actually have to pee. Now it's time for the fun stuff. Like we posed and we've earned the donuts. She brought donuts. Them. Like she it's knows. It's honestly the best place too. So I had to. I had to. This is my favorite bakery along with Katie's. Are you ready? Oh my. Oh my. It's crazy. I, I know. I know. <laughs> Unexpected. Like you see that. <laughs> And then it's filled in the inside. It's like a cake batter filling. It's next level. Do you have any words of wisdom, advice to like girls, women who want to go to the gym, maybe feel yeah. like kind of discouraged about it? Yeah, just be comfortable, confident, and just showing up at the gym. Do it for yourself. Don't do it for anyone else. And work with what you have. Love it. Thank you so much. Yeah. I'm gonna enjoy these donuts. Yes. And I'm just gonna enjoy these donuts. <laughs> Got it. We don't need to leave if you don't. My body, it's a garden, so I'm gonna feed it a garden. I'm doing this for me, okay? Like, look at this. We literally have mother nature here. There's so many colors going on. I'm extremely excited. I don't put much meat in my mouth besides shrimp or has a 405 bench, but, you know, a lot of good nutrients, antioxidants to fuel me after that workout. I'm gonna take this dressing and put it on the salad and treat it like how the guys imagine treating me and give it a rigorous toss. I literally had one of this thing just travel down my throat hole. <clears throat> no gag reflex. That's delicious. There's nothing better than eating healthy. You know? I ordered double meat and I can barely find anything. Like, don't be shy. Show me your meat here. But literally three shrimp. And there's like a damn freaking forest of veggies here. We got some big things to do right after lunch. So we gotta get some energy. We have some very, very important business to do and I need the energy for it and that is to take Instagram photos for literally the next two days. I got myself an energy drink to keep me going, keep me perky. We got the Witch's Brew flavor, naturally flavored. Very perfumey. Get a vague hint of feminism in here. Overall, really good, very sweet. Let's go take some photos. Can you just take a quick Insta for me? Okay. Would you mind taking a photo of me real quick? Just for my Instagram? <laughs> I have a sweet treat to beat the heat. You're doing a lot of bodybuilding, huh? Yeah, a lot. Yes. Yeah. Do any of you guys want this? I can't have it. Oh, uh, it's okay. It's not open, so I can't drink it. I don't have any room anymore. You take it. It's you gotta pay it forward. <laughs> it's for you. Okay, thank, thank you, sir. You. I'll make sure to tag you. Yeah. Turning into a raisin, can I get a chocolate covering to save me? Shit! The 
Gymshark drop. People don't understand pre-launch anxiety is real. It's a real thing. The latest gym wear drops are a must-have. Securing your size in the latest neon and pastel apparel is the only way to stand out on social media. Regardless of how many others I bought from the same Whitney Simmons collection, this isn't retail therapy. This is retail cardio. And this means war. Oh my god, if Jess gets this set and I don't, girl, maybe focus on getting a good spray tan first. Who is Monica even wanting to wear these for? We all know her ass is the last one her boyfriend pays attention to. Carol, could you just let me have something? You could have a poncho on your ass and it would still look better than my face. Hopefully she gets camo prints so no one notices that pancake butt of hers. Bitch. Yes! Workout complete, Instagram's been uploaded. Pretty much my life's purpose is complete for the day and now it's time for dinner. Dinner, we're going keto. I'm not changing my diet. I'm just changing my lifestyle. Keto simply is 25% protein, 70% fat, and 5% relatability. The foundation of tonight's dinner is the golden snitch of fit girls, and that is an avocado, because we're making some pretty badass avocado toast. Let's see if I know how to pick them. Drum roll, please. Oh, I'm not uploading this to Instagram, that's for sure. We always say the best ones squirt when you eat them. And I like a little bit of a kick. I like to make my, my cheeks sweat, all four of them. A lot of red pepper, and then some cilantro. It's not about eating well, it's just how little can you possibly eat. Because you want to keep that waist thin, the booty massive. I'm going to take off the protection. Mm. There's way too much green going on on this plate. We've got we to brighten it up. So we're going to add some cherry tomatoes, and boom. My drink of choice tonight is gonna to be some rosé, girls' night out. Why rosé? Because I don't wanna stain my teeth in my sleep with red wine, okay? Okay? So on the top right here, it's kind of weird. It says, best enjoyed with friends. It sounds like something my pimp used to say about me. It seems like they're kind of like automatically assuming their customers like to drink alone, which is, which is pretty stupid. I'm freaking thirsty, Jesus. That is so sweet. It tastes like it's Valentine's Day. I'm alone in the dark watching cat videos. Oh my God, there's so much avocado toast, it can't even hold up. That's why being keto sucks. The bread that you have can't even hold the freaking spread. This is literally keto summed up. This is like your heart, just boom. The more I'm eating this, the more I hate this damn bread. You know, obviously today, I'm doing stereotypes. I don't know if you can tell by now, but I've been joking the entire video. Fit girls, girls at the gym, they train hard. As you can see today, they train heavy. They have balance with their diet. They'll have donuts, they'll have salad, they'll have a bunch of other things. And I have a lot of respect for women, girls that go to the gym. It's not an easy place to be, especially being a woman. I can't even imagine having all these eyes on you, feeling like you're being judged. My overall respect for fit girls after today went through the roof because that posing is definitely not easy. Give it a shot and let me know in the comments down below. So I'm gonna wrap it up here. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to drop it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and I'll see you guys in the next one.